Hello and welcome back to another driveway. Today we're going to tackle making some lighting. It's like, uh, as you can tell from some of the videos, we kind of get some fuzzy grainy thing going on because the camera doesn't like low light. And with the whole time change and everything, I'm going to be doing more work in the house without electricity in the room and in the middle of the dark. So we need a lot more light. And I found that the uh, work lights, nice stand work lights, cost an arm and a leg. So let's just make our own. All right, essentially what I'm gonna be using for this are two of these contraptions. We got just the light socket piece. It's got a rocker switch on the back. They make these for holding like those uh, lighting umbrellas that you see for photo shoots and that type of stuff. And then we got over here, it's a five socket that we put 60 watt replacement daylight LED bulbs in. So we got two of these contraptions. So I'll have one there, one there on a old tripod that I found at the Goodwill for six bucks. So it'll be a lot cheaper and a lot more light. All right, so our first stop is a pair of perks. Like it short. Don't drop things on the floor. We got just simple pipe nipple. It's like what, three eighths? There we go. And that. We can just screw on into the end. Hey, it works. All right. So we got those two. And we'll just got our tripod here. Alright, and we'll have that kind of just mounted up on the tripod. Ta-da! And then put these guys up at the end. Look good. You just need to grind some holes for the tube in the end here and drill a hole in the middle. Alright, it's a little bit noisy in here with the furnace going, but we got a hog at the end, screw in the middle, hog at the other end. So that'll make it so we can lock and load our pieces on. Now that we got to do, probably gonna have pound this a little bit flatter so it's a little more usable. All right, get my nipple ends and let her fly. Got that all zapped up. Alright. 
and it runs a little faint.